All right, here we are today with a Giga Venom deck for Kiss My Axe. This is exactly the same as Chuggy Giga, but with a Venom instead of the Chuggy. Literally the only change. I don't know. I, I find it hard to believe this could be better because Chuggy is so strong and you have to open a third building to get out your Venom. But yeah, we'll, 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 play, we'll play some games of it and see how it goes. But yeah, I think... I think this just seems like it's going to be a worse version of the Chuggy, Chuggy Giga deck. Alright, so here we go. First game. First game of the Giga Venom deck. So I guess we want to try and like... We probably want like our end game comp... What the hell? We want our end game composition to be something like... Um... Something like, uh, what am I trying to say here? Our end game composition probably wants to be like a Giga Cannon with some Venoms around it. But we're getting, uh, we're getting Laser Drone Rush. Laser Drone Rush is pretty bad. Laser Drones don't have good harvest damage. You actually kind of, like, if you look, you can kind of see the, uh, you can kind of see the Venom is doing, like, as much damage to the Harvester as the Laser Drones. So, yeah, it's just real bad. I wouldn't... Wouldn't recommend the laser run rush. I probably wouldn't have recommended it back in the day, but now it's even worse. It's like, what are you doing? Alright, well, nice rush and stuff. Okay. <laughs> Oh, he's going for the half, boys. Let's try and save it. Save the harvester! Probably like his only way back into the game is killing this harvester. Uh, yeah, this game's for sure over. Super duper over. Now it's just about the blue balls. Make sure he doesn't get the harvester. Alright, it looks like he's not even going to try. I think we're just done here. Nice rush, though. The thing is, like, it's, oh, I know I've said this so many times, but I'm going to say it again. Let's say he gets this Harvester. What happens then? He builds a Harvester. That's it. That's his reward. His reward for winning the rush is that he gets to build a Harvester. You could just, you could just build a Harvester at the start of the game, man. Like, why are you so keen to rush? Rushing is so bad in this game. Objective complete. Alright, game number two. Ooh, slash fields. This map is banging for a Giga. Well, we are up against Solomon. Solomon's pretty good against Giga Cannon. You can always just Solomon a Giga Cannon at an appropriate time and that gives you an out. Oh, he has level 11 dogs. Okay. And he has level 10 Solomon, I just realized. Okay, well, never mind then. Never mind. I think my lasers will smash these dogs because they're plus two, so they one shot the dog. Yeah, this is this kind of stuff is super annoying because it's like you don't get a proper game at all. He did open dogs with Solomon, which makes me think he's probably playing an aggro Solomon deck. But it's just so. Oh god, he's playing snipers. I think. Snipers at minus three as well. Like a whole volley kills a rifle model. It's just depressing, man. Grab a Venom. Oh, it's just so sad. This snipers can't even beat my Rifleman, this is just sad. I could probably have won this game with only Rifleman, because they're plus two on the dogs. I'll probably beat them pretty handily. I guess we'll get a Giga out, but... Very depressing game. Not very, not very exciting times. Giga does way too much infantry damage as well. 
Ooh. Walker. I'll run away and try and get a phantom. Yeah. Just depressing. Bit of a non game. Alright, silly hilly. Good map for Giga. Very, very good map for Giga. Rifles? Yeah. I don't actually, I think I'm gonna get there slightly behind him, so I don't wanna engage that fight. Interesting choice to move up like that. Now, who wants to stall? I don't actually know who wants to stall here. I'm not 100% sure who has the better late game. It's difficult to say. If, if he doesn't have... If he's not playing Giga, it's probably me. Especially on this map. Unless he has, like, some kind of weird tech unit in his deck. That seems unlikely, though. So I'm pretty sure I want to stall. Looks like I'm losing this rifle war. I really don't want to switch into uh, Venom though. I, I hate myself for doing this. <laughs> I hate people who do this, but you can just make a Giga Cannon in a rifle mirror and it does win you the rifle mirror. But yeah, I hate people who do that because it's just like... The Giga shouldn't win a rifle mirror. It's so dumb. But it does. <laughs> Well, here comes the Banshee, the one of the weakest units in the game. <laughs> Banshee really is terrible. Yeah, I'm quite out. Mm. on my bikes here. That's a lot of Banshees. And we have three one-man bikes. This is going to be a problem. See if we can get both our lasers in position. No, not quite. Yeah, we just had too many one-man bikes there. Could probably have perhaps not have gone bikes. Wow, there's so many banshees, dude. What the hell? Let's get a phantom for the venom. Oh, is a tank? Okay. I don't know why he's made a tank, but sure. We're going to do a Giga Cannon soon. He's gonna lose his pop cap again, I think. Let's get the Giga Cannon out. No, it looks like we're fine. Another phantom out. Giga on this map is pretty good. Actually should not have gone second Giga. I was thinking that I can probably Giga and Phantom to kill everything, but if he just spams like four Banshees again, then uh, the double Giga is going to be not that good. So I think I'm happy to lose a Giga here. Man, look at the Giga just tearing things apart. Like, even the lasers coming in and just getting wrecked. Such an insane unit. Ready to 
Such an insane unit. <laughs> so broke, man. Oh my god. I don't feel good about winning this game. <laughs> Giga is so stupid. You are victorious. A great Giga map, so might be looking to play this game without the Giga Cannon as much as possible. Rhinoceros. All right, let's get the laser. Put it with the rifleman. Now you can beat a buggy with this combo. I think you can beat a rhino as well. I think the thing about rhino is it has more hit points. Has more hit points and higher damage than buggy, but it moves slower and has lower attack rate. So its DPS ends up being like about the same as buggy, I think. Maybe even worse, which is stupid. Like if it's gonna be slower. It should, like, it should, it should at least do more damage, right? I mean, I don't know. This seems dumb that Rhino is so much worse than Buggy. Alright, so... See what he switches into? Hitbolt. Makes sense. Could be a pretty easy miss off for me here. Yep. Like I'm gonna make the Giga just because obviously I don't have anything else really against the pit bulls. They just surrenders to Giga. Alright, Giga, Giga strong unit confirmed. Opponent just surrenders. Elite Ace. I like that. Have you ever called George Black Razor when playing board games? Uh, I don't think so, no. Oh yeah, what, what George said is probably accurate. Maybe in reference to something. Maybe it's Elite Force? How could that... Oh, you're right. Because 4 is in Force. Very smart, Jeffrey. This is why they pay you the big bucks. It could be Elite Force. If you're if you're uh, if you're watching this, Elite Ace slash Elite Force, please let us know. Please get in contact and let us know which one it is. Oh my God! Look how few hit points that Giga Cannon has. Absolutely disgusting. Oh my God. So gross. They should change Giga boost. Oh, the way boost interacts with Giga, they should change it like they did with uh, Orca. So it doesn't actually increase the like rate it ramps up at. I think the problem is that it's a number of attacks before Giga ramps up rather than amount of time firing. So Oxana boosting it means it ramps up faster. LOL. Such a dumb unit. Oh my god, it's so disgusting. <laughs> so disgusting. Got him. <laughs> It is, it is an, yeah, it is like an entertaining unit, but also it's just so broken. Destroy your, destroy your. <laughs> I've got some bad news for you, Destroyer. I think you might have spelled your name wrong there. I like it though. He knows, he knows what he's about. And it's destroy your ring things. I don't know why I went second rifle. I should have waited to see what he was doing. You shouldn't, you shouldn't make the second way at the half, so I would have gone second rifle anyway. But I should have waited until I saw that to make the second rifle. Let's see what his first unit's going to be.
Ooh, shock trooper. How exciting. I guess we'll go straight into Venom. What I should have done is have my rifles near each other so I could double team this shock, but I didn't do that. So, you know, punished. Bring a laser up to protect the Venom. Okay, so he made one shock trooper. Which, surprisingly, was not enough to win the missile. I don't want these rifles anymore, so I'm just gonna let them go. Oh, okay, that's sad. I do want my lasers. Hammerhead? Oh no. This guy appears to be pop capping me. I'm gonna make a Giga Cannon. I don't want to make a Venom against the uh, Hammerhead. The alternate anti infantry unit in my deck, the Giga Cannon. Okay, well. <laughs> I mean, maybe if you didn't have two harvesters, friend. <laughs> Malconero. I don't think he had Wolverines, Pablo. I'm pretty sure he played, uh, he just played Snipers. I couldn't beat Snipers without the Disruptor. And the Disruptor didn't come out in time. If I remember correctly. That's how I lost my, uh, my 15th game with the double tech. So our opponent's playing Jade, which already indicates to me this is not going to be a particularly high octane game. Why did let me have the 3v2 here? He's for sure making Chuggy. Yeah, there it is. I would have gone Giga if I had the money, but maybe I should have waited. I was only like 10 or 20 off. I can go Giga next. I'll definitely do. Boost the Giga. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, got him. Feels good, man. That one was a little close, but... We got that. Just keep throwing bikes at that Giga. Feels good, man. Giga is a dumb unit. You should really have to block. Like, if, if bikes and more pit bulls are repeatedly getting to your Giga, you shouldn't be able to ignore them. That's pretty obnoxious. Aha, joke's on you. I can beat your infantry with my Giga Cannon. Ah, Shade. Now the joke is on me. Put the Phantom there, and GG. <laughs> GG, my friend! <laughs> Would you like to hit the concede button? <laughs> Can I interest you in this bottom a left area of the of the screen? <laughs> so gross. So gross. Objective complete. All right, Inferno. Uh, yes, big rig. Uh, Boner Jams did make it to Tiberium League. First first month I played it. Good evening, my dude. New house tour when? Winking yeah, up, face. Thank you for the sub, man. New house tour when? I don't know. Do you guys actually want me to do that? I'll tell you what. I'm doing cooking stream at some point, right? Like that was one of the rewards for my streamathon that we achieved. We made it to cooking stream, so I could do house tour maybe on the cooking stream. Alright, so Inferno is called Inferno. I'm hoping he has Infernos and not just Chuggy. But this this opening leaves me a little vulnerable to a Chuggy. I don't want to just make a Giga either in case he makes an Inferno in response. Ooh, he went 4th rifle. That's very unusual. 4th rifle means I probably could have gone Giga. That means he's pop on Rifleman. But obviously, like, if he has to walk in, then I still win. Def Defender's advantage. I don't know if I should be happy to stall. Like, I have a Giga Cannon, so maybe, but... I'm not actually certain that stalling is the play here. 
unit offline. The park makes so many rifles now, it's getting a little silly. The only thing I really can do though is make like a giga- uh, to break this stall would be to make a giga cannon. Now I have enough money to go giga cannon into phantom, so actually that's probably the play. And I want vision. Oh, it's laser drones, that's kind of annoying. And venom? Okay, so we do want to make the phantom still. Now I just sit here doing nothing whilst I wait for Pop Cat. The classic rivals experience. Confessor? Okay, I should not have waited. <laughs> Although I can probably just beat Confessors with uh, with Giga Cannons. One would hunt. But yeah, that's real awkward. Confessor? I did not see that coming. Yeah, I mean, I didn't know he had a tech splash. This is this is not great for me. This is very awkward. It's gonna be a weird game. We should get first missile at least. And I, I think I think Giga Cannon is actually our answer to Confessor. I think that's that's where we're at. Like we have to use Giga Cannon as our anti-infantry, which is so dumb. It's the world we live in now. <laughs> Mutant? How do you have mutant as well? What is happening? Oh my god. <laughs> what is this nightmare scenario that I've found myself in? I don't even need my half. I'm just gonna let him have it. I actually don't want it. The half is the half is a pop cap that I don't uh, I don't that I want back. It, yeah, I'm very happy if he kills my harvester. I think it's just an additional pop cap I can have. God, this isn't looking great. These mutants, man. <laughs> I don't think a Venom's gonna hold out that long if I send it diving into Confessors either. Actually, wow. Confessors are so bad. Wow. Kind of insane how well this is going. Like confessors are just terrible. Wow, confessors are actually just terrible. I literally just spam venomous to kill the confessors. <laughs> Feels bad, man. Alright, view it. He looks pretty decent player. Playing Kane could be good against my Giga. Gotta be careful with my Giga if there's gonna be a Kane. Ways to play around it are to block obvious Kane spots, make it harder for them to obelisk where they want to. Uh, keep the Giga out of vision is also a really good way to do it. Like if they put an obelisk down and you can move your Giga out of their vision, then the Kane won't fire at it. I see how it is. I see view it. What a cool cat. Trigger on Giga. Oh, mutant as well? That's a problem. Get a bigger cannon into play. Oh, 
I need venom here. Oh wow, that's a lot of mutants. Get the venom down here. You won't be able to counter it quickly. Should just win the missile. Very decent. Keep the Giga alive. Really important. I don't think it's gonna. I don't know if it's gonna happen. We're gonna take some damage at least. Ooh. Might if you lose it. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. That's a beating. Alright, let's see if Giga can anything kill enough stuff in time. I think the answer is probably yes, Giga can is pretty nuts. Oh my god, it's so nuts. What a what a unit man, what a unit. Jeez, it's so dumb. <laughs> it's so dumb. Another victory for the mighty Giga Cannon. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Buick again. Can be the last game with this one. Pretty great. Uh, pretty great map for me. I do actually think that potentially against mutants, the uh, the Venom version might be better than the Chuggy version. But Chuggy is just so strong. It's kind of hard to say. Because I'm debating whether I want to go for like a fast Venom. I think no. I'm pretty sure I want a stall. Can't really get a stall though. Here we go. Now we can stall. Alright, if he moves out, we'll do this. Get the 3v2. Now we can stall again. He'll probably go chuggy. No, he's going right for it. It's interesting. I'm gonna go Giga if he goes chuggy. I say he probably goes mutant now. So I want to save up for Venom. You might want to obelisk this, so I'm going to move it back one. Like, you can put an obelisk here. You can't put an obelisk that can hit it where it's, where it's back there. Alright, so we're going to go Venom. Yeah, because he's going to go Mutant. Makes sense. So we'll get the Venoms in place in front of the Giga Cannon. It's going to be really difficult for him to beat this, honestly. Like Venom surrounding the, he's almost certainly an all ground deck, so Venom surrounding a Giga is just super hard for him to beat. He might try and go for my Harvester to distract me. Looks like that's what's happening. We can use the Giga to hold that off. It's no biggie. We're also rapidly approaching the stage of the game where I just don't care about my Harvester. Again, we need to be careful about Obelisk, I'm going to move back one. Phantom, okay, that's a problem. I'm going to make my own Phantom. Stop that shenanigans. Yeah, so the obelisk isn't even going to be relevant here. Alright, well, yep, you get pretty good on this map. Uh, we, we just stayed here to stay away from the obelisk, like, look, this obelisk is irrelevant. If we'd moved up, we could have got obelisk, so... Just being very cautious of our Giga. Uh, so yeah, there you go. Pretty similar to the Chuggy Giga deck, honestly, like... I think maybe, like, a little bit worse. Because Giga, because Chuggy is so strong, but... 
Giga is real strong. Like, a lot of these games showed how absolutely insane Giga Cannon is. Like, some of those games were just absolute nonsense with the Giga Cannon. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed that one, and I'll uh, see you next Update time. Update your setup and get a new haircut. Thank you, Big Rig. <laughs>